Good morning everyone. Today I've got a couple of things to wrap up. I need to fix some bugs before releasing my gold truck application, create the app store listing and of course destroy my back at the gym. But before all that, let's make some breakfast and my morning coffee. So I'm on the balcony and I got with me my Cortado and today's plan is to finish this coffee then I will go to the bathroom to brush my teeth and then we will go to the gym and after that it's a coding session but I don't know if I will come back home and code or I will stop by a cafe and code there so we will see so Let's do it. I've been going to the gym for about 2 months now and I can really feel the difference. It helps me stay focused, boost my mood and honestly gives me a reason to touch some grass. I know that sounds funny but since I work from home I don't actually need to go outside every day. Hitting the gym 4 to 5 times a week really makes a huge difference. After a good workout, I like to reward myself with a great cup of coffee. The app I'm working on right now is called Evolo. I spend a lot of time polishing the onboarding process to make sure the information is clear and helpful but to also increase the conversion of the application. By the time this video is out, the app should already be live on the App Store. If you're curious, go check it out. It has a free trial so you won't be charged. And I will also love to hear your feedback about it. Also, someone asked me in the comments if I use a database to store my application's data. For most of my apps, I just use local storage since they don't really need the full backend. That said, knowing how to build a backend yourself is an incredibly valuable skill. So if you ever wanted to get serious about backend development, you should check out boot.dev. Boot.dev are actually sponsoring today's video. I've been messing around with it and it's really fun. You can learn Python, SQL, Go or even TypeScript all at your own pace. What makes it different is that they made learning feel like you're playing a game because you earn XP, level up and unlock achievements. There is even a bear wizard named Boots who helps you without just giving answers. He guides you in the right direction when you get stuck which is awesome. They also have a training ground where you have endless coding challenges so you can practice as much as you want. 
Plus, you can explore all the lessons and resources without paying, so it's easy to see if it's right for you. So if you want to give it a try, you can use my code DANIEL to get 25% off your first year or use the link in the description. Thanks to Boot.dev for sponsoring today's video. Anyways, a pretty funny thing about being a programmer is that we basically get paid to Google stuff. But I think that only makes sense if you already know how to code. If you rely on AI to build your applications entirely, you will never really learn how to do it yourself. Aside from a regular job, you can build solid business to business or business to customer products on your own. And who knows, maybe one day you won't need to work for anyone else just for yourself. For me that's amazing and it's what really pushes me to keep going and succeed. After all that, I started feeling hungry, so let's head back home and grab something to eat. I made a chicken burger, but I was so hungry that I completely forgot to record it. Don't worry though, I will make it up to you with the dinner. One important thing I have learned is to take short breaks between work sessions. It helps me clear my mind and also gives me a chance to stretch a little. Later on it started getting dark outside and of course I got hungry again. So I cooked a Tuscan pasta recipe for me and my girlfriend. Honestly, I swear I was born in the wrong country because Italian cuisine is by far my favorite. I feel like I could travel to Italy just to eat. It's been a really productive day and I hope you enjoy spending it with me. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that like button so you don't miss any future videos. Huge thanks to boot.dev for sponsoring today's video and I'll see you in the next one.